Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Anil and from today we are going to start a new series on ReactJS. So I already have a series on uh, ReactJS on my channel. So why I am going to create a new series on ReactJS? There is a lots of reason. First thing is that this series is basically a completely job oriented series. How at the last of every uh, video I will ask you a question and it will help you to get a job. Second thing you can get the all of uh, my videos code on my github account so you don't need to copy the code from videos after pausing it and you can just pause and play and pause and play so this is not comfortable with you you can just watch my video and at the last you can just get the code from my github account link of uh, the every videos code you can get in the description box right third thing is some guys actually saying that the sound quality or video quality is not fine for them so I hope in this series you don't need to compromise with the video and sound quality, right? And at the last of this video, we will create a two project, one with the React or you can say that the core React and the second project we will make with the React and React Redux uh, library, right? So now let's just jump on this video. In this video, we will learn that what is React, why we use it and the topics that we are going to learn in the upcoming video so the first question is what is react so react is basically a javascript library yes this is a library so uh, basically uh, sometime we are just comparing the react with the angular that's okay we can compare it but angular is a framework right and react is a library so what is the difference in both of them so basically when you just uh, use any framework then you will find a lot of feature in it right like uh, with the angular you can get the validation routing api calling method and much more things but with the react you are not getting these kind of things right so for that you need the external package yes these are uh, very much official uh, the package for uh, routing or you can say that the validation uh, or uh, api calling methods right but they are not provided by the uh, react actually Right. This is you can say that the basic difference between React and uh, React library and Angular framework, right? So what is the main focus of React? So React's main focus is building UI as fast as possible, right? That's why we call React is very fast, and uh, most of the time, uh, just clients asking for the React because this is really fast. So this is the major feature of it, right? So. Uh, why we use uh, the react js for making a single page application so now what the heck is single page application i will show you show the demo right so here you can see that we have a two website one is any news website and second one is the react official website so this is basically a single page application so when i will i am just going to click on any link you will find that there is a no loader and page is actually opening a very fast right so but whenever i am just going to uh, open this uh, sorry my bad open this uh, news website and I'm just going to click on any link then you will find that there is a loader and complete website is actually loading again and again and it will take too much time and this is not even user friendly also every user actually hate to loading as you know we also hate to loading right so that's uh, now I hope you understand that what is a single page application in a single page application we load our complete website or a single time and then we can use it and we can jump here and there there is a no loading kind of things and complete website is very fast what actually is react do here it will just make a single page application we don't need to just load our website again and again right so why react is fast every will everyone is just talking about react is fast react is fast. how it's actually fast the reason is virtual dome i will make a complete video on virtual dome after one or two videos right just after starting this series but uh, let just discuss the major difference with the virtual dome and the real dome and why this is fast when when we are using the real dome what actually happens so let's say we just want to update this list on a button click and in the updated list we just got only one item for update so let's say the tea is same in the updated list milk is also same but coffee is just replaced with the uh, cold drink right when we just update it with the angular or normal website on a button click 
it will again just load this complete list right it don't care what uh, just uh, before is there and now what is uh, the new data is coming it will just update the complete list that's why it will take the too much time so now we have only three products or you can say that the three items so when we have complete a long list or a long div h1 tags and much more things then it will take too much load right but what actually virtual dom is happen in a virtual dom so when we want to update it on a button click it will just match the previous data and the upcoming data and just find that okay so i just need to just update only one uh, list here the every uh, everything else is same so it will update only one list it will don't it will don't touch even the other things that's why this is a really fast right so i hope you get my point and uh, now why we learn react right so we can learn a uh, view js we can learn the node js and angular much more things but why we need to focus on a react first thing this is maintained by the facebook so uh, when any framework or library made by any brand right that means it will just a long term player it will not gonna die within a one or two years it will just play around 20 to 30 years easily right sorry guys then um, second thing is uh, it's highly demand due to the fast speed so there is a lots of job in here right the third thing is there is a large community for your sport so if you just uh, want to answer something on a react this you can just uh, Google it and you will find lots of answers because there is a lots of supporting community for regarding to it There is a lots of developer so you can just find the answer from easily on the internet, right? The last thing is very important You can also make the mobile application with the react native if you know the react you can learn react native within a you can say that week Right, so if you know the react very well, I'm repeating my word if you know the react very well you can learn react native within a week and you can make a mobile application also and these mobile application can be android as well as ios right so this is another uh, reason to learn okay so let's talk about the histine version so as i told you this is maintained by the facebook and first release on the 29th uh, may uh, on 2013 right so around seven year ago it was released and now the current version of react is 17.00 uh, you can check here right and uh, some famous app with the react is uh, let's say netflix and uh, whatsapp web instagram airbnb all are working very fast and made in a react so uh, what you need to already know when you just uh, uh, learn a react so you can say that the request prerequisites right so if you know the HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, you can easily start with the React. You just you just need to know about the basic things about JavaScript. You don't need to go in the advanced Java, right? JavaScript. And if you understand the ECMAScript five or six, that will uh, really make you comfortable with the React, and you can learn easily. If you don't know about the ECMAScript, then don't worry. Uh, we will just learn everything from the scratch. Even it will not make you hundred percent fine because. Uh, uh, the react is also a basically JavaScript so if you know the basics uh, thing of the react uh, or basic things of the JavaScript then that's okay and if you know the uh, some things with the ECMAScript then it will great right otherwise that's okay you can still learn the react with the basic things of JavaScript and obviously this course from the scratch so if you don't know about the ECMAScript 5 and 6 and advanced JavaScript so don't don't worry we are just going to learn from the very scratch so why you need to choose my course because there is a lots of course on our react js yes. so first thing is that in the every video you can get some interview questions and it will help you to crack interviews second thing is we will just come around with the 100 videos in this complete course you will get a project with the react js yes, project with the react and redux and at every saturday you can ask me in the question in any language like hindi english punjabi in, in whatever you are comfortable in a, a live session and uh, if you don't get a time by 8 p.m. then that's okay you can ask me the question on a uh, Instagram also so you can join me Instagram on this link so what we are uh, just going to learn in the coming video react setup and installation react basic obviously hooks routing advanced there's a lots of topic in advanced like context API or uh, you can uh, say that the portrait mode and uh, 
the another one is uh, mm, 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 lifting up state and uh, some other libraries like like uh, react material ui and all and we will uh, just uh, play with the apis also then react with the redux react js project and interview question also on uh, saturday and as i told you you can join me on insta and uh, you can get the answer obviously within a one day sometime i just i might be don't get the time with the same time but i will try to answer you in the 24 hours so thanks for watching this video if you still have any question or query or review kind of comment you can just attempt in a comment box and thanks for watching this video please like this video and subscribe my channel bye bye god bless you